Hey everyone, it's me, Jason from Blog Norfolk, and it's a beautiful day. It's a wonderful day for foraging. So why don't you come foraging with me, and I'll show you some of the great things that Norfolk County has to offer out in the wild. Like this wild ginger. That's right, did you know we have wild ginger in Canada? You just pick it out, you can see the root, much skinnier than that root that you get on your ginger that you buy from the grocery store. But the smell is exactly the same. Leaves look like this. We'll pop up some links too later to show you how to identify some plants. If you notice too, they have a flower on them like this. And if you see something like that, you've got wild ginger. Sorry we haven't been posting. Um, we know you guys have been looking forward to our posts, uh, but we've just been trying to keep things going during these crazy times. There's so many benefits right now to getting outside and really enjoying the sun. Um, it's gonna do great for your mental health during these times. And you know what? It's good for your exercise too. Another fun thing to grab is skunk cabbage. Um, if you get it when it's young, like this, you can pull out the root, boil up the leaves, and eat that as well. May not smell as nice as the ginger we just picked, but it's still gonna be super tasty. Here we have some daylily shoots. You wanna get them while they're young. You can use them in salads. You can use them in stir fries. All kinds of tasty uses. There's all kinds of recipes online as well. We've just found one of my favorite things to forage, fiddleheads. So these are just baby ferns before they start to leaf out. These are delicious. Fry those up with some butter. It's almost like asparagus. So good. I'm gonna put these on a pizza, but you know, you could do lots of different things with them. 